notch back here. This time for part three of the Chevelle build. We'll be doing some suspension and brakes, getting the chassis all set up. We'll be putting the rear end in today. Last time we got the motor and transmission all in it. We'll get ready to get this thing going. Lift her back up. We can actually see what we're doing here. Oh, damn, yeah. Motor and trans looks good. Mmm. And I knew this thing was going to be a nice build. Actually, do have a couple steering knuckles for it already, so that's kind of nice. Oh, nice. Have a control arm already, too. I guess having to go and buy some parts. Yep. Nothing there. Upper. Oh, we've got a couple uppers. Cool, we can get the uh, suspension started on it. No front sway bar. Regular one. Double wishbone. Alright. Some parts coming. Need at least one of those. Sway bar itself. These babies popped into place. Old coil spring. Where's it hiding? There we go. Really love having the tablet on here. Saves a lot of hassle. Probably need a couple of those. Shit, I backed out too far. Nice. Get the suspension all put together. What is this? Link B. Okay. I've been in the shop all day, so it's kind of funny to uh, get on here, work on a car virtually after doing it all day in the garage. A little interesting. Kind of funny, though. Vented. Okay, vented brakes. You're shabby. No brake pads. have a caliper though so that's kind of nice so try to save as much money as we can on this allow us to do a little bit of custom stuff towards the end of it actually okay, yeah I was gonna say there's got to be a cap that goes in there too it's hiding on me Looks like this side is pretty buttoned up. So then I get a steering rack in it. And probably need an inner and outer tie rod end. We'll just pick those up real quick. Okay, where's the outer? I was gonna say you're hiding on me, aren't you? We don't have a wheel yet. Ah, we got one of the classic wheels. We're not going to go that route, though. We're going to dress this thing up a little bit. So we got one side buttoned up completely. Oh, show. That's pretty badass. Back into assemble mode over here. Get the knuckle on, get the bearing. It would have fell on the floor because there's not a damn thing holding it on. We have the upper. Let's pick up a lower control arm. My handy dandy parts catalog. Get all the goodies we need. Have any of that? Don't have any of that. 
Let's try to do a, a bundle buy here. I'm gonna say that we need this. We need this. Here and outer tie rod end. Okay. Try to get a bunch of parts all at the same time. Zoom out. God damn it. There we go, game. I'm act all crazy on me now. Bam, bam, boom. Liking it. That group by action. We'll pick that up too while we're in there. That sway bar link. Hiding down towards the bottom. Sneak in there and get these tightened up. Perfect. Yep. I think we're going to need everything for the brakes on this side, I was pretty sure. Caliper tightened up. Also got to get that little damn hub. Hiding all the way down here. All the way at the bottom. Okay, that side is complete. Nice. Front suspension done. Nice and brand new. I'm digging it. Badass. Alright, now we gotta get back here. Oh, oh. There we go. Do we have one? Oh, we do. We got the nice new rear diff. Have a leaf spring. Had one. We do have a plate. Got a U bolt already. Nice. We can start bolting this right in. Oh, wow. I'm actually really surprised that we had uh, a lot of these parts. Had to go through and refurbish a lot of things, but. That's how you gotta do it sometimes. Clean the old parts up and reuse them. Still good. Just because they're dirty don't mean they're bad. Okay, I don't have a drum. Wow, we actually did pretty good putting this side together. Not too bad. Need some bushings. Okay, so I have none of those. Let's get some small rubber bushings. Pull those real quick. Make sure this side's in the car completely. There we go. Tightened her up. We need a brake drum. Nice. That side's just about buttoned. I'm liking it. Just about Benjamin Button down here. Need a uh, shock though. We're gonna have to do that. And it's the shock absorber B. Hiding right down here. Sneaky little bugger. Damn, that's what's up. So we need housing. That knuckle housing B. Out back. Perfect. We already had the axle. Reusing the old goodies. Wheel cylinder. Nice. I already have that. Drums. The shoes, I mean. Need a drum for it. Need a leaf spring. from me. That tightened up. We're going to need another U-bolt. 
And this parts supplier, they probably love me right now. Yes, sir. Get whatever you need. Love how quick they are with delivery. Makes it nice. Everything, just about everything actually is all buttoned up. A couple more of these little bushings. Bushings, whatever you want to call them. Depending on how fancy you want to get with it. I think that is her buttoned up. Not too bad. Front suspension, rear suspension, rear ends sitting all in her. Everything's tightened up. Almost ready to do some burnouts. We are getting close. We need a drive shaft for it. Okay, where's it hiding? Not under. The fuck is this shit hiding, man? Oh my god. Okay, we're just gonna we're just gonna type it in. Okay, wow. I say. I didn't even like how I spelled it because I put it together. Like, no, no, I can't comprehend what you're trying to tell me right now. The old typical park guy thing. Um, uh, what, what were you looking for again? Since we're under here, we might as well put the exhaust, button everything up in the bottom half of her. So we still have to get, let me see, need some mufflers for out back, right? Nothing, nothing, okay, we need all sorts of exhaust pieces. All sorts of them. Ugh. This is where it's going to probably get a little pricey. goodness right here. Right, I'm going to have to get mid mufflers. Uh. Man. Killing me. My cost right now. Oh, okay. At least it's done. At least it's done and everything's brand new. That's what I wanted. tank and the fuel pump and everything all set up to oh wow I already had never mind I shouldn't have bought it <laughs> Never mind. That wasn't a good idea. It was not a good idea. That's how it goes sometimes. What are you going to do? That's how she goes. That is front suspension. All put in her. Everything's nice, tightened up. Nice, brand new brakes. Got the exhaust. All set on her now. Rear end put in. Everything nice and new. She got a set of 373s in there. Didn't tell you guys that before. 
uh, nice new brakes out back, exhaust system, like I was saying, and uh, even the fuel pump now. Fuel tank and pump, which is pretty sweet. I guess basically, on the next episode, we'll be getting into uh, doing the bodywork, finding a set of wheels and tires to put on it, still figuring out the paint color that we're going to go, and then we're going to have to get it all buttoned up. So it'll be wheels, tires, bodywork, then we'll probably have to get it into paint. But it's been fun. I'll see you guys for the next one. Y'all take it easy. Peace. I should try to drive this one time.